Hi, I'm Zobit, and I'm going to show you the latest Blocks Fruits leaks, in this video. Stick to the end to find out how to get the Dragon in the next update. Netflix. These maps look so good, and they said in their tweets that they're revamping the maps to look better, and up to date. The Haunted Mansion looked so much better than before, same with the factory. I wish they would make more canon stuff to One Piece, though. Utterly. These new GUIs look fire. The developers really stepped it up with this one. Blocks Fruits GUI currently looks better than those of Grand Peace Online's, or Fruit Battlegrounds. Not to mention to see how through Triple Katana is getting reworked, same with Trident. New scrolls are coming to the game, probably for upgrading, or maybe Fruit Awakenings. Now, when upgrading your weapons, you might need to sacrifice fruits, which will be crazy to do. Imagine having to sacrifice a dragon. Again, I love the go away. Leak you've been waiting for. This is the leak that I teases in the thumbnail and at the beginning. The theory I have is that you may have to do a quest to get free dragon. For example, the quests you might have to do is, kill 50 bosses in 3 hours, or kill 50 players in a public server without dying in a short amount of time. These quests should be hard, at most I think you might have to kill Rapindra by yourself without dying, or something RNG. If not, I think there might be a type of gambling system, where you have to sacrifice fruits to get other fruits. For example, Putting in a rumble fruit and having a chance to get perm Buddha, or putting in leopard and having a chance to get perm soul. Those are my theories of how to get perm dragon in the next update. Next time, I might do a video inside of this update. Comment down below your theories.